there are less than a thousand bags of this coffee available. And we're gonna do a little cupping of this coffee and kind of walk through what makes it so special today. This took us a few weeks to dial this one in, and I think that we finally have it figured out. So it's starting to smell a lot more like, um, kind of like dried fig, like a lot of like nice dry fruit. And then you're getting some subtle sort of riper fruit character in the back. It's the dry fruit that I think is the most dominant flavor in this coffee. Yeah, immediately I get like a burst of that nutmeg uh, sweetness. It's sort of like a, like a Christmas coffee in a way. Um, it's got the sort of black tea and the nutmeg with some like, almost like grape or like uh, red currant, I think. Yeah, it's got a freshness like a red currant. It's very potent and pungent, but uh, really sweet and round. And I tend to gravitate towards more chocolatey, nutty kind of coffees personally. Um, but when we get coffees that are fruit forward like this, that are just so rich and balanced, it's, uh, it's hard to say no.